Jesus. Oh, no, he's here. Oh, yeah. You alright? Yeah, I'm alright. Yeah, right. uh, you can come in if you want. Nice one, cheers. Uh, how are you doing? I'm alright, how are you? Mm, okay. It's a bit weird, I've not done this before. Uh, no, neither have I. I, I, I don't think so. I don't no, think no, I've done this before. Don't uh, what do you want to do? Uh, what do you want to do? Oh, I appreciate you taking your shoes. I appreciate you taking your shoes. Oh, uh, right. What do you want to do? Oh, what do you want to do? Uh, do you want to go watch a, do you go watch a film? Yeah, yeah. Are you sure? Let's go watch a film. Which film? Dumb and Dumber. 365. Right, enough of that. Enough of that. Enough of that. Bull enough. We want to hear about your stories, you know what I mean? Saying that, if we asked you for your stories of your first times, no matter how embarrassing or how funny it was or how nice it was or how saucy and delicious it was, mm. we want to know what it was. So we asked on YouTube and Instagram and you replied, so we're quite happy, you know what I mean? This is what we want. This is what we want to hear. Yeah, it's I mean? nice to get feedback from all you guys and it's uh, nice to have some funny stories to read out as well, to be fair. So we have got a couple to read out and then obviously we'll share our own. Uh, maybe, maybe, maybe. This is how it's all out, you know what I mean? Energy! After I thought it. Either that tastes nice or your lips have got a good bubblegum flavour to them. Well, that's a good start. You know what I mean? So let's let the comments begin. Here we go. Story number one. It's embarrassing, but. But every guy I know is still a virgin, including me. These questions make me so. Oi, look, it's alright, your time will come. It's all about patience, it's all about that right moment. Don't be worrying about it, alright? It's all Oh, you about know what? You know what, Ben? That's alright. That I was going to yeah. skip that question and not even give it up. That's a nice little bit of advice yeah, there. Right Just is. whatever Ben said, then we'll have taken champy. Right. I didn't hear him. My first was. <laughs> what? No! My first was with Sam. <laughs> Definitely the last, because he's the only one for me. My imagination. <laughs> I love you, Sam. <laughs> I don't mind a bit of that. From a girl or a guy? I don't remember this happening, but you know what? If you want to think that happened, it's fine with me. It's fine. Think about it. If anyone wants to think about it with Ben, go for it. I, 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 I don't know. Uh, my first time was so dirty as in yuck. <laughs> I don't even know why I did those. <laughs> my childhood friend gave me a BJ. <laughs> then we caught. Then we were caught by my father. Lol. And it was like, what? Uh, so that's a good story. And it was like, what? Not what? It's by a guy as well. You imagine imagine if you hadn't even come out to your family and you just get caught yeah, in imagine the middle of some hard stuff right there, man. I bet it was hard. That, yeah, that naughty stuff where no one's allowed to know. Imagine the sight that his dad saw. Even if you're in like a, a guy and a girl relationship, it's, it's awkward. If, I think that'd be even worse. It's awkward if your dad comes in or something, isn't imagine it? Imagine you were like, you had a daughter and you just walked in. Oh, I'd hate it. I'd hate it. I don't even I don't know what, what I'd do. do. I just, I'd, I'd genuinely probably just shut down. I'd, 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 <laughs> I'd erase the pile. <laughs> you open the door and yeah. just And don't move. I'd just, I'd just like dissolve in my clothes. You'd just see like clothes on the oh, floor. Like Avengers when they're just... Yeah, 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 yeah. Do you? But my clothes would be remanded. My first kiss was with my childhood friend, CJ. Hey, hey! Big smoke! It's me, Carl! Chill, chill! One time we were hanging around in my room at my house with books. Oh, yeah. <laughs> with books we're and stuff. They were study they were studying. Oh, I bet they were. I get it, I get it. Hard. Hard studying. Yeah. I yeah. came across this one book that's something about gender and sexuality. And I don't remember how it got there in my room. It just slipped okay, in. Just, it yeah, just okay. slipped in. Is oh, what that means it's a sign and it's meant to be, you know. It slipped I mean? in. It slipped in. I got curious because I've never seen that one before. I opened the book and read some lines from it. We were kind of nerds back then, so he was there sitting and listening besides me. There was this one big sentence in a paragraph which we found kind of silly and we laughed at. I don't remember what sentence was about, but after that one he began to move closer to me and I was continuing to read lines from the book, but obviously I ignored it. I don't know why you ignore that, you know what I mean? I used to try to pretend to ignore it, you know what I mean? But obviously I ignored it, and I thought he was getting interested in it. A 
again, we were nerdy back then. <laughs> Then I came. Geek, oh, geeks are freaks. I, I saw what are they now? Geeks are freaks. Then I came to this one sentence at the end of a paragraph, and I stopped reading and just looked into this huge. Oh no! Wait. I looked. I looked into this huge image in the book. I can't remember what the image was, but I think it was some chart or something. This has got to have a good ending to this whole flipping. I know. Right? Then he landed his finger into one of those little images on that page beside the huge one. I looked at him, and he was speaking some things about it. I can't remember. How much can you not remember? This must have been something special that happened if oh, no, you, just right. your mind got blown away. I can't remember what he was exactly saying that time, but he was explaining some things. After that moment, it all got quiet and kind of intimate atmosphere. All right, now we're getting juicy. For real, we were like, I don't know, 10 inches apart, each other sitting on the bed. I going to say something else. They even remember the, the amount of inches between them. Oh, right, I bet guys, this, is some, this is some serious talk. And as I began to read something from the book again, he just went for it. He just dot 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 went for it, which were like a bit of a... One of them. Alright. Crazy part is I... I look... Oh. Crazy part is it lasted kind of long. I was like that. And thank goodness the door was locked because as we were kissing, I can remember my little niece playing around somewhere outside my room. Another crazy part is we continued on hanging and messing around after that like it never happened. Oh dear, Though, poor I, niece! I we haven't finished it. Though obviously there was some awkwardness. To this day I still can't remember, but not very vivid, vividly. I may have left some details out because I can't really remember and this was five years ago now. I don't have a very good memory. Oh <laughs> well. And as you can see I'm not good at telling stories either. We didn't have any romance or something at that time, just friends. And he literally just went for it. And I know to this day he has a girlfriend now because we're still neighbours. So yeah, a bit confusing. I was confused too at that time. It was by a guy. Uh, maybe you were a bit confused, but I'm telling you that was definitely dragged off. If you've ever been on Pornhub, there's a <laughs> section that says stories. And I think that's where it came from. So, you know, big ups to the anonymous. Oh, I think he's telling the story of Ben and Sam in that one. Oh yeah, <laughs> I don't know about that one. Uh, right. Inch the app. Oh. 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 <laughs> I can't tell you that one. That's the name of them. When I was in college, I joined a text dating group and started dating someone through text. Text dating, that must be back text in the day. Text dating, I know, right? We decided to meet up. It turns out that it was my college professor from SAD. I don't know what that Ooh, means. Oh, from SAD. He's not that old. Just a five year gap. So we think professor and think, are you are you going for a bit of an older? Professor always sounds a bit older, like Einstein type of age, you know what I mean? Yeah. Maybe he's a sexy. To my surprise, we're both into, and yeah, he's gay, I'm gay. We pretended we didn't know each other, like nothing happened. It takes some time to adjust. We're both discreet until we decided to come out of the closet, not at the same time, not at the same time. So we ended up being besties. Oh, I bet they literally came out of the closet physically. After mm. bang, yep, is what they say. Hi, serious talk. That was alright. I like the little professor story. I like them sort of stories. You know, if you ever like, because I used to have crushes on teachers at school all the time. There was this one, my IT teacher. I really fancied it, like big time. And try, oh, some PE teachers at school. They were, oh, oh they were yeah. a math teacher that would just. Oh, oh I look. Mrs. So, hi, Miss Green. Anonymous nine two four seven eight. You have, you've got it, a good little. Oh, yeah, a, a toast to Miss Green. Yeah. Wherever you are, in this world. Hi. It's short. <laughs> it's Not short. wrong with that. I think I can't tell if he's trying to say he's got a little one. Oh, it's a short story. I peed in front of my house when I was twelve. When I was twelve, I was literally running so fast to get to the door to unlock it, but it's too late. I'm so glad my neighbours didn't see me. I'm from Singapore, so we live in HDB, and the doors are so near. Sometimes my neighbour would just sit and leave the door open and the gates closed. That's why I'm so worried, haha. And that's the story. So you didn't even say all about having sex, <laughs> did you? Right. Oh yes, hey, it was good though. You know, you had to pee outside. Sometimes you got to do that. Yeah. All right, Richard, big up Richard. You know what I'm saying? All right, Richard. All right, Richard. We know Richard. He's been in the live streams. He's on both right, our Richard. channels. He's a big supporter. He's Richard. So come on. What have you got on your lips? No. It tastes like <laughs> not good. good. I'm a great kisser. About my first time to flirt. To flirt. Okay, we're keeping it modest. I like it. I was failed. I failed because <laughs> I asked the boy if he liked me and then he replied quickly, find another boy you want because we are the same gender. Ah, oh, it was a funny moment because of my innocence and of many things. Okay, so like, okay, yeah, so you scared the guy away because he wasn't gay. So what happened? Huh? 
So, about my first time to flirt, so he tried to flirt with a guy. So he, asked, tell me like your he tried to flirt with a guy. Tell me like your term means and he, you. told, he told the guy that he liked him, but then the guy what? the guy said, find another boy. Oh, so he's got the same gender. Oh, so, if, so he's saying, I'm not into that sort of stuff, but if you are, you're going to have to go find another boy. Oh, so he liked a straight guy. Yeah, 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 yeah. So he must have liked a straight guy. Not if you're gay. Would you ever consider going with a girl? Do you reckon if you're gay and you've got to have sex with a girl, you might just think, Ass. Do you reckon now, if we had sex with a guy, we could turn gay? No. Do you reckon I don't know. Like, I genuinely, I believe in the, the, the fact that you are born gay. If you are gay, you are born gay. I don't feel like you could just turn gay. In my opinion, I... Was Philip Schofield born, born gay? Or not? Yeah. He was born gay? 100%. So what's he been playing at, knocking back out his wife it, because he's, he's, it's When he was brought up, it wasn't accepted. Like, it was only in our grandparents' lifetime that people had to take chemicals to get rid of the balls because they were gay and they went to prison for being gay. Yeah, but how so, did you so feel like, gay? What do you mean, get Get hard. Get hard. Well, you know, you, there's the tablets called Viagra and I'm sure you can just imagine a man if you... you for that many years though? Yeah. Yeah, but it's, he's probably easily done. Well, same way straight. And now he can be himself or maybe the, the elite group's telling him to come out as gay so it looks more accepted to the world. You know what I mean? Who knows? It's a mystery. Yeah, you it's weird, know. isn't it? But I'm saying it's the wonders of life. Yeah, I'm saying I genuinely believe that you're born gay. Right, hey guys, I hope you're doing good. I just want to tell you that you should react. Show. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not comfortable talking about my first time. Ah ha ha ha. Well, don't comment on the post then. Hey, I'm from Indonesia. I'm now 26 years old. While well, my first time is I'm cheating on my first boyfriend when I was 16. What's going on? Yeah, that's even strange. Your first boyfriend as well. So you that's didn't even. Yeah, yeah you, didn't, you didn't even do this stuff with your first boyfriend, you just did it with somebody you cheated with. I, I, come on, shame on you, man. Shame on you, but it's all accepted here at the Gilly HQ, you know what I mean? Maybe, maybe this first boyfriend wasn't good enough, you know what I mean? Yeah, maybe the boyfriend, you know, it was too, you know, it wasn't ready for that stage of his relationship yet. Do you regret doing this choice? Do you regret it? Do you right. wonder what that berry tasted yeah. like? Yeah. What that fruit, right, what you that ready? banana. Right, let's do it. Oi, are you ready for this? Oi, hold the, hold the thinking ball. Reduce. Hold the 100,000 ball. Not old, isn't it? My first time was to flirt in our neighbourhood. I can't translate it. My first time flirting in our new neighbourhood. Yeah, but you might want me to say it like this. Is it a girl? Can't tell a picture. Yum. My first time was to flirt in our neighbourhood. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. It's been a long time ago, but that was my first time going out to our house at three o'clock in the morning. My God. My God. My God. That's exactly how I put it. I just met my neighbour and then we talk and he knows what's next. <laughs> That's so yucky. Hey, but I learned that day. <laughs> it just says, I, I love you, Ben and Sam. Please follow me on Instagram. <laughs> been watching you guys since you first started. I don't know if that's true, you know what I mean? Cause it's been a long time. It's been over a year, I tell you that much. Back when you were humble boys. Oh, oh maybe they are. You know what I mean? No, I it knows, it knows. Because it's a lady. It's a lady. A lady. Growing up in college, I always had a bit of a fetish. For guys with really long facial hair and bodily hair. I don't know what that would mean, you know what I mean? Don't really that there. I don't know what you think is funny about bodily hair. Okay. So after my first night out in college, at Freshers, Freshers, you've been out in Freshers, you know what I mean? No. Oh, it's wild, it's Freshers, you know what I'm saying? Sway. Never been to Freshers. Sway. You can imagine. I got a little bit, a little bit drunk and it was a really long night and I lost one of my friends, supposedly. Oh. Uh, I got a text saying she'd gone back to her apartment and she could leave me a key outside. Uh, on my way home, a guy from behind, who I'd seen earlier at the club, who had the thickest beard I've ever seen, with some also some pubic hair coming out from his shirt top. Some pubic hair? Brackets, <laughs> chest, chest hair. hair. Okay. Said, where are you going next? No, that either, guys. And I'll be honest, I'm not the best at saying no. <laughs> he gave well, you got to learn to say no. <laughs> Gave me a certain look, and the next thing I knew, he took his key out of his pants and waved it at me. I knew exactly what he meant. Now that's some Oi, dog. These that's, people that's at dog. uni just giving it. That's a dog. As if that's something that happens in the movies, isn't it? He took a key out of his pocket and waved it. So yeah, that's something that happens in the thing we just back. watched before this video, you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We ended up going back to his place, I mean, I thought it would have been the best experience of my life, to be honest. I'm a virgin. I didn't realise what pubic hair does whilst you're having sex. So he asked me to go down on him. Oh, this guy's not messing about, you know what I mean? Doesn't so, have any I, I, You know what I want to know? How old is this man? 
Oh, in my first day at uni, a man with a hairy chest and beard. And a big beard, yeah, maybe. Look at me and Ben, he's nearly about 48 years old. Can't even crack his first yeah. armpit there. Yeah, literally. He asked me to go down on him, and the lights were off, so I couldn't really see what I was doing. But the next thing I knew, I found something in between my teeth. I realised... Cube. It wasn't that great to have that much facial hair. Um, facial hair? It wasn't, that, hair. it wasn't that great to have so much bodily hair. So basically, I kept on going. But by the end of it, each one of my teeth were completely full of black hairs. <laughs> by the end of it, I had to pretend that I had to go to the sink because I was too hot. When in reality, I was washing my mouth out of his oh, pubic hair. Oh no, from all the pubes! Aye. But Brack, is, it still ended in a happy ending oh. for both of us. No! That's my story. Thanks, Sam She actually ben. said that as well. Well done on 100,000 subscribers. I'm from Manchester. I oh, aren't saying is, what's the point in body hair? People like We're only saying that because we can't grow it. That's no, not. but I mean, like even people are like, oh, we can grow it. No, we not grow with body hair. If you, it, no one wants pubes in between them. No one wants to be coughing on a hair. You know what I mean? Nobody wants to be coughing up a hair. Yeah, hundred percent. If I would, I would never. Are you saying you manscape? Yeah. Yeah. I would never have someone fight their way through just to get to it. No. It's not that small. It's just like if it's the if there's a bush. If there's a bush, you know what I mean. You don't you don't want. You want quick access. Mm. Easy access. You want to be like, it's here. Don't worry about it. It's clean. It's, you know. Yeah. I've, I've opened the gate for you. How old and did I you say she was? You know what? I hope you've learned from them. You know what I mean? I hope you never went back to that guy. That's mad. I mean, who waves a key? You see that? It's a bit of rain. Oh, yeah. No, I was just about to say the key moving thing. That's something you see in a movie. I don't even know if I believe it because of the key wave. I believe it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, after you take a couple of sips of that, all was possible. First message I've got. Oh, these Instagram messages, you know what I mean? From going. a lady, I'm not going to say a name. Anonymous lady 242. Right, so this is, from, this, is from, this is from a guy. This Trump. This is from a guy about a girl. Oh, sorry on the squeaky chairs, but we can't afford yeah, them, no, you know no, what I mean? No. So, so, please don't make merchandise. <laughs> so, basically, hi guys. Dun dun dun, here. My first time was around seven years ago when I was 16. I had a crush on this girl in my IT class, which is like computers and stuff. Uh, we sat opposite each other. I always, we always stared at each other and exchanged uh, messages. So I'm guessing they had like a messaging. So he was 17 at this point? 16. 16? Yeah. Oh, so 23 now. Yeah, okay. So, well, he said seven years ago. Yeah. yeah, so 23 now. Um, this is like that year 11 type of stuff. Yeah, this wait, is wait, year 11 stuff. We're thinking you like, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so we started to message on this messenger, and it was just playful at first. We used to play uh, tanks online and stuff like that. Oh, yeah, oh yeah, that's a tanks, keeper you know, right there, yeah. yeah, that's a keeper right there playing tanks. Yeah, tanks. Yeah. Um, long story short, one, one Friday, we had a double period at the end just before school closed, and about half an hour before the bell went, she sent me a message in IT on the computer saying she was having a little gathering at her house that night. Right before the bell went. This is all. Alright, just, be, just before me. the bell went, I got a notification from the messaging service, from the message, uh, from her saying that she's having a gathering at her house later on tonight. Oh, um, and, little parties. and if I wanted to come over. And I'd never been invited to a party before. Oh, this guy sounds innocent. I didn't know who to ask to get me a drink and all of that stuff, but I will not bore you with that. Uh, fast forward, I went to the house that she sent me the address of, and I knocked on the door. I oh, waited about 30 seconds, no answer, so I rang the doorbell. Luckily, it was a big house, so the doorbell worked. And she answered the door, it was just her and nobody else. Oh, I like this. she said it was a gathering. I'm latched on this. And it was just her and nobody else, I tell you. I tell, okay, okay, so she invited me in. And I, I said, when, when are the others coming? I didn't know I was like so early. Um, and she said, nobody else is coming. Aye. Uh, <laughs> nobody else is coming. Nobody else is coming, what? Nobody else is going to have to come. Um, so in my head, I did think, what's going on? But I didn't say anything out loud. We had a few drinks and was talking on the sofa. A few drinks at 16, no? Yeah. Aye. And Imagine drinking that. her parents were out all night. And she said they weren't coming back for a couple of... Her parents... She said her parents weren't coming back for a couple of days because they were on a holiday in France. So oh, rich kids at New York. Um, right here, you know. We kept talking and drinking, and I was very drunk, to say, it, to, for the sake of my age. She asked me if I wanted to stay over, uh, and I said yes. I had to make up some quick excuse uh, 
for my mum and I told her that I was staying at another friend's house. And I had football training the next morning, which was only a short walk away from her house. Aye, Aye. so it's convenient, but he doesn't have his football kit. Oh, it's going to be a weekly occurrence. Maybe he got up early, thing. maybe he got up early or borrowed one of his friend's football kit. So what happened that night? Um, so one thing led to another. We went upstairs and it started with an innocent spoon. <laughs> Oi, it always starts with a little spoon, I tell you. What's deadlier? A spoon or a massage? I think a spoon is, I don't know, they're both very deadly. You know what's the deadliest? They're thing? both very deadly. A spoon in this is more deadlier than a massage. Eye contact in that. Eye contact in this is ridiculous. Oh, imagine this, imagine this. Just reach for that champagne bottle right now. No, no put, it, put it down. Grab the champagne bottle. Oh. Oh yeah, <laughs> you see that? That happened that night, you know what I mean? We ended up having an innocent spoon. Was it innocent? No. And what is an innocent let's, spoon? No, and let's just say it wasn't so innocent. It was both of our first time and we are still together today. What? So how did he slip it in from the spoon? Um, is he just leaving out not, these he's details not for us? leaving out the dirty details for us to see. I, the I, thing is, it was an in-depth story so I liked it and I kind of liked how he kept it on the PG side. You You've know either got two sides of this story. You either spooned and she said, we get on with it then. You know what yeah, I mean? She were hasty. Yeah, it yeah, took yeah, five yeah. minutes and he were like, you know what I mean? Oh, he, like, he did a bit of, I bet he like whispered in your ear like, yeah. yeah. And then he did it again like, yeah. Like yeah. that. Mm. Oh, baby. Oh, I know. Oh, baby. <laughs> Let the boy <laughs> become a man. Met, on, met this guy, in brackets, yes, this guy, via Grinder. This is another message, by oh, the way, guys. What's it? I'll keep my identity, it's private. Yeah. Met this guy. Yes, this guy, because this was coming from a guy. Oh, hey, guys, we know. We, we know. know a lot of our followers we, yeah. are gay, you know what I mean? Chill it's out. It's all right, don't worry Tell us, we love living in this juice. You know so, I mean? met this guy, via Grinder years ago. I came from an earlier meetup, and he was driving around the area. Oh, yeah. Around 1 a.m., he saw me in the app and asked... Hold on, what did you say? From an earlier meetup? I came from an earlier meetup. And he was driving around the area. Does he mean he'd already met someone else on Grindr? And yeah, then it's just come maybe, back? you little player. Oh, you're on fire. Hey, yeah. hey, you picked that up pretty you're, well. You know what he's doing? He's grinding. He's grinding. He's grinding. He's grinding on Grindr, I tell you. Around 1am, he, he saw me in the, the app and asked me where I was. And then he picked me up in Burger King. Yeah, I don't trust this guy. Already driving around 1am, just going around. And he picked saying that. I bet he's winning. Burger King. Burger King. Burger King. In Burger King. I could, oh, Oh, I'm so hungry. Oh, oh, I'm starving. We drove around and discussed what we are up to. Oh, oh yes. Obviously, sex. Play. Obviously, sex, he put. Then you need to help me this. Then he said that he forgot his wallet and he doesn't have cash. As he was my type, I said I'm willing to pay for the room. Who goes out on a drive without your wallet? Yeah. Or cash? I mean, what if you need petrol? Or your ID? Or you hit like a nail and have a flat tire. Mm. Mm. Alright, well maybe you just wanted to, you know, use your money, exploit it. Oh, you've got you got to be alright, you got to be alright with that and you if can you just it want a bit of the... To my surprise, he had different plans. He told me that he was actually, he actually thought of doing something different. He said he wanted to do it in the car. <laughs> so he didn't, he didn't want a hotel room. I have, room, I have no idea why he's laughing. <laughs> he didn't, he didn't want it. He didn't want it in the hotel room. So he didn't have to pay for the hotel room. I was a bit hesitant and asked him, where can we find like a spot where people can't find us? Oh, you know why he didn't want to do it in the car, in the hotel? Because he got no money. Because he wants to do it in car. No, but then he said he paid for a hotel room, didn't he? Oh, our, our yeah, guy. Yeah, yeah. Our, our guy, storyteller. Our guy said that. Storyteller said oh, he man. paid for it. So he, maybe he didn't want the cuddles and kisses afterwards, you know what I'm saying? They just both wanted this. Oh yeah. Where can we find it? Like a spot where people can't find us. He looked at me and smiled. He looked at me and smiled and told me that we won't be parking. We'll do it whilst driving. Oh. Well, where can we find a spot? <laughs> Don't worry. We won't be parking. We'll be driving. <laughs> And that's what that's how it happened. The rest is history, guys. Jeez. The so that's the story. Is, literally, the rest is history. <laughs> I want to know what happened. P.S. My hands on the steering wheel, his feet on the clutch and brake, and his hands on the gear. What? So his he, hands were on the, on the steering wheel. So he's like this. <laughs> no, hands on the steering wheel. My hands on the on the steering wheel. His feet on the clutch. So he's like that, and he so they're they're on each other. Oh. Like that. Yeah, and then, uh, yeah, so he was like, so you were messing with so that he, he, No, he was <laughs> and, and, <laughs> and this guy in front is driving, the, the storyteller's driving. Oh, they were still driving? Yeah, yeah 
No, 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 no. so they're actually doing it at the same time. So my man's got his hands on the steering wheel and he's turning the steering wheel. The other guy's doing the, the clutch and everything else <laughs> and the gear stick whilst they're just bonking. Oh, you must be petite or small. You must be a small You must be guy tiny, bro. That's going. some... Oh, no. Oh, good story, That's though. That's story, one yeah. of the best ones like today. That. Yeah. Ben and Sam, yeah. please tell us about your first times. Like, well, I tell oh, you oh, what. Oh, 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 oh. Let me take right. the talking bottle. So through school, Sam grew up here. And I thought, I look disgusting. Oh, I'm so I'm so ugly, you know what I mean? I'm so... I'm so I'm so weird looking. I'm never I'm never gonna get girls. I'm never gonna get them. You thought that? I was like beans. My grand I'd go see my granddad and he called me a bean pole. And I thought <laughs> I'm actually a bean pole. I don't even know what a bean <laughs> pole is. A bean pole. Like who looks at me and thinks, oh yeah. I thought everyone else is getting it but not me. So years went by. Year eleven, year twelve. So this is like year sixth 12, form. Sixth form, college. Sam gets to college. Never touched a bit of never touched a Never seen it live. So this one in the fateful night year, I've been seeing this girl at college year. And then next thing <laughs> I knew it was like, we started getting along really, really well and thought something could happen. But I always had this bad thing in mind where I don't want to come on to someone, I want them to come on to me. Yeah, I'm like that, you know. I yeah, you agree know with me. that. Like you don't, because you don't want to like, overstep, fall, the line. overstep the line and get rejected. Yeah, I, I, saw, I saw all my mates saying, yeah, I've done all this and this. I, was, should, I, I literally say this back to them. You bet, you bet, I bet she didn't even want you to do that. I bet she didn't even want you oh, to do you that. that. You have that, you, you just because just you come on to them, that's why they feel like they need to do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But now I look I back at myself guy. and thought, why, why? I, I see, girls and guys want the same thing. They want, they want like, if you like someone, you both you both want to come to each other, you know what I mean? Mm. So this is what, we were talking for ages, and she'll probably think, Sam, get on with it. And then I invited her over to my house one night, yeah. Daddy went out. Just out of nowhere, you know what I mean? Oh, you take a sip, take a sip for this. Daddy went out. Sam's on his own. This girl comes over, and I'm like, getting proper, proper hot, and getting proper red in my face, like, oh, what's going on? There's a girl in my house. You know what I mean? Like, there's a girl in my house. There's a girl in my house alone. And she's looking at me, and then uh, we were, I like, should we go to bed? You know what I mean? Should we go to bed? And then we went upstairs. So she, she'd come over to, like, she'd plan to sleep over, yeah? Yeah, and she was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. So from that point, now I should have been thinking yes, a hundred percent. But at that time, I'm like, oh, she's just my, she's just, she's just, she's, I'm my like gay best friend in the other year, right? I just, you know, I mean, obviously she don't fancy me, and uh, she just, she just took her pants off in front of me, knickers around. I thought, what, what's going on? Oh, righteousness. Oh yeah. Right. And so then that it, means she was already down, man. I'm just thinking in my head it was still like, nah, she's got clicks to bed. as you get older though. She's gone to bed. She sleeps like this. She sleeps like that. And then she started doing all the little like. Oh, look, look. Oh, Alright, right. yeah. hello. And I'm thinking, oh, she's just trying to get comfortable, isn't she? She's just trying to get comfortable. Like, try to just dispose of any compliment oh, yeah. or, like, inkling. Oh, or, yeah. yeah. That and you then, could, just to try and make it seem like you could, well, just to try and make it so you could stay frigid. And then I'm still kind of, I'm robotic. So Sam's like... frigid at this point. <laughs> no, I'm serious. Yeah. Like, not in a bad way, I'm not saying frigid's a bad thing. If you're oh, frigid's oh, frigid right. fantastic. Frigid, oh, people you people want you more than you think, I'm telling you, frigid respect, people. But I tell you now, once you hit your 20s, you're a little s***. <laughs> and the next thing, she turned over and she was like... Sam. <laughs> <laughs> and she started kissing me. And then they made like, oh, this is actually happening. Happening! Everybody stay calm! What's the Everybody procedure, everyone? Calm. What's the procedure? Stay calm! Oh, I've got one. What about that? And then, like, I just thought, I have to perform this. I have to do this action right now. But my stupidness was one of my mares, who she do not like at all, thinks she's alright. So I, I just started tripping. I'll be honest. I'll be honest. I put my hand. I used my hand. I used my hand. I confess. I confess, <laughs> the hand happened that night, and then for some reason I just said to her, I don't think we should do it, you know, I think we should just go to sleep and then see what happens. And then I was like, why would you say that? Because I just thought, why would you say because that? Because I was still being pole, no one fancies <laughs> I was me. still being pole. Being pole, no one fancies oh. me. And then we woke up that morning, I woke up and a bra off, and I just thought, what, what's happening? What's happening? And I just thought, this is it, Sam. Sam. I was like, it was like a <laughs> cutscene. Isn't it funny how you just talk to yourself in your own head? When you're in these situations or like when you're first like dating someone or you, you're always like talking to yourself in yeah. your head. You're always giving yourself this pep talk. You're always saying, do I do this? She, she, she totally likes me otherwise she wouldn't do that. Should, should I lean in now? I need to wait for that perfect moment. And you're just like, it proper, perfect you know, moment. It's constant like, battle in It's your like head. I floated out of my body and like looking at myself like Sam. You know like when you get the bad yeah. angel and good at you. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Do it. Do it. You're gonna, she wants it. 
it's your life, so you know what I mean? So you know what, you know what, it's for, you know what? I'm doing it. Alright, I'm doing it. Alright. <laughs> I never was thinking, what shall I say, what shall I say, I'm going to say something really good. I think I just said, let's do it. Oh, <laughs> like really? That. Yeah. Let's do it. At that point, when I said, let's do it, I thought, engaged. I am engaged. I am going to perform. And then clothes engaged. came off. Clothes came off. I've never done anything before. I thought, what am I doing? I don't even know where it is. What it is. <laughs> you don't, it's deceiving how low down the entry point is. It is very, first. yeah. I'm glad you said that. Yeah. I thought you were going to laugh at me then. Yeah, no, it is. So I was just saying, I, I can't do it. I don't know where I'm going. I don't, I don't know where I'm going. Are you just there at the top of it? Just at the top? <laughs> Try to I'm it. flipping around leg going like that, ups, down, left side. Yeah, I'm like, whoop, yeah, whoop, yeah. whoop. Yeah. I, like, I, don't, I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know where I'm supposed did to wait. Did she help you out a little bit? She was like, huh. I literally said to her, I'm like, I can't even imagine what she was thinking. I'm like, I, I need to see where I'm going. I need a better angle on this. So basically, she she got in... To a different position. She got in dog style, right? Don't know how to say that. Understandable. Nice she got into the most visible position where you can see everything. And then I, I, I entered, I, I made entry, and I remember at the exact moment, I just thought, what is going on? And I had these mirrors on the side of my wall, and I was just looking at myself, doing it, thinking, what, Sam, you've done it. Like, I was thinking at the same time. What, when you when it was in? Yeah, there were like, there were two mirrors on I the side. The one mirror yeah. were like, Sam, you're doing it, lad. And then the other one were like, what are we, what are we doing? Yeah. What am I doing? What are we doing? What am yeah, I doing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it must have been like 60 seconds and I just lost. I, I said, what am I doing so much that I just kind of like, it's not working. Like, it's, I wasn't working. I'm like, we'll try it again another day. You know? Oh like, dear, shut down. But shut, you know shut, what, shut, guess shut what? Down. I walked out of that room like that. I walked out of that room like... Hi baby girl, see you later. Don't worry about it. Take a safe journey home, you know what I mean? <laughs> I'm walking in like this. <laughs> uh, I'd like to end my story with this. No matter... How many people you've done, I think the first time with everybody is always going to be different. And it's never going to be what you expected yeah, to be. Yeah, first time, not in like your first time ever, like your first time with anybody Yes. different. Passion like, only comes when you're comfortable. Yeah. You know what I mean? First time's a bit awkward, it's a bit like, oh yeah, hi, you know, this that, is me, me, this is you, let's learn each other. Like, yeah. Yes, the way the body moves and everything, yeah, 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 you just, your emotions. Just each other. Let's wrap it up. Um, in these videos... Are you going to do yours? Oh, no, 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 no. Why? What's wrong with it? it? I can't be bothered. <laughs> Come on, it'll be funny. No, no. Just I'm just I need privacy. I need privacy in that. For what? I mean, for what? My life. What's going to happen? Okay, you fine. You peer pressure with me. I was at college, yeah. I went to oh, college yeah. studying music, and this guy, I was quite close to him, good mate. A guy? Oh, it's not a guy, <laughs> don't worry about it. I was quite close to this guy, a good mate. Like, you know, when you get a good mate at school or something. Oh, yeah. I was texting this girl on BBM, if you remember that. And I Let saw it. I, I, yeah, yeah, I saw a picture in the icon of the BBM. I thought, oh, yeah, she looks alright. Is that? He's like, oh, just a girl I've, I've had sex with. In a bit, bit more of a disrespect. I thought, oh, yeah, I said, is it your girlfriend? He's like, no, no, no. And I was like, I don't believe that you've had sex with her. Because I saw my mate, and he, he's not a bad looking guy. I'm not mates with him anymore, but. Oh, the thing is with this, if you don't claim, like, saying you like someone, if you're just. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 if but you just banged her previously. It's like, so. Yeah, like, so he's just said that. I bet, I bet he cried really. He probably was very upset. Uh, he would. He probably got upset after he knew what's happened here. Yeah. But before that, it's his own fault. Yeah, you know exactly. What I mean? But anyway, so Come on, she. What so I said, have you, so I said, I don't know if I believe you if you have, like, if you've had sex with this girl, because she was, she was very attractive on this picture. Yeah, I just didn't believe it. You know, when you're a kid and you're just a bit like some fine bit of stuff, like you're sleeping with. You just be joking. Yeah, so girls, girls, girls. You must be joking. Girls kissing girls. Who does that other than models? You know. Yeah. I mean? So anyway, we had this. This chat and anyway, blah blah blah. I was like, all right, whatever. And then he texted her in front of me and said, "Did I, didn't, did we sleep together?" And she said, "Yeah." So I was like, oh yeah. Anyway, so about a week passed. I just forgot about it. So she admitted to sleeping with him. All right, right. Because I wanted the proof. Oh, you um, wanted him. I seats. needed that proof. I needed I the receipt. Like, I bet you like. I got the receipt. Oh, but, and I bet you got a bottle no, no, of champagne. No, no, I was alright. Because it was like it was I like months ago. It. Months ago. A week later, he shared her BBM pin to all his mates. Why? Because that's what they used to do. They used oh, to like they want share the pin so they could have more friends and stuff like that and like talk to more peeps. Anyway, so I added it, yeah, I saw the pin, I was like, aye, look, let's let's fire in. I said let's fire in, you know what I mean? I'm I'm innocent, I don't know. Like, let's fire in. Yeah. I'm gonna fire in, yeah. basically. Didn't have a clue. Didn't have a clue about anything. So I'm like, alright, so I message her and I'm like, aye. I'm like, aye. I said hello. It's, oh, so you uh, didn't say aye. Nah. I was just like <laughs> I was just small tall, like hey, blah blah blah. Anyway, one thing led to another. We started talking a bit more seriously, a bit more sexually, all right? You know, one thing led to another, that's how it goes. And then maybe a couple of weeks 
or months, maybe like six weeks later after talking to her. I plucked up the courage to meet her. I bit, I a bit timid back then. What? So you did you ignite the let's meet? Yeah, um, I don't know. I think we both kind of did. Oh, anyway, so like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I ended up going to her house, um, and the first time, no happened. Like I slept what, I slept over an hour two. I was just like, yeah, I slept over, and then obviously I did the spoon and the bum with guild kind of. Shit. I, the thing and is, I was like, I, I just got a bit too paranoid and a I bit too like, I got too in, intense. So I was like, I can't. I, d I just I didn't want to do it. I was too scared, basically. This is to find out if someone really likes you, though. You could go over and not do it, and they would want you to come back again the second time. You could go over and do yeah, it the first time. It wasn't like that, though. Like, I didn't really me. like it like that. Oh. And the second time I went, and I thought, you know what, I had in my head. Because she would definitely try and last time. I thought, you know what, I'm going to do it this time. She had a really annoying dog, too. And let's just say uh, it got to the point where we would go to sleep, and uh, it just started the fire lit. I I kind of went like that. I don't know. We just started kissing, and then it happened. Oh, and just then say, like, you started kissing and what? And then that started happening. She went on top for a bit. Oh, just and like what? So the just, first thing? Yeah, yeah. Just went on top. Who thought, does that? I just thought, what is this? I bet you were like. Yeah, I was. I was like, oh my god, what's happening? And then I thought, ah, right, okay, let's try another. So I like we, we changed a few positions and had a bit of fun, and it's it's probably the longest I've ever lasted in sex. I bet you were talking the exact, the exact <laughs> no, way. Ben was just talking to the camera. Then I bet you all. I bet you. Nah, that's true. I bet you all. Ben were talking to her the same way. He just spoke to you. He closes the left side of his lips and goes, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah you know what I mean. Let's change position. You know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, we just had a bit of a position change, and then. Uh, that was it. Was it there a good ending? Finished. Yeah, yeah, everything finished. That was good, and then I know. maybe saw each other a few times after that, and then uh, ended up getting into a relationship with someone else. So, like you, we're doing well. Sam's got a nice, good, good-looking girlfriend. I've got a few, you know, fishes on the line. Joking. I'm joking. Ben's got a good old reel. He's gonna reel it in one day. One day. Uh, but either way, let's close it on that. You know what I mean? It's like two hours long. You know what I mean? I want you to tell us your story. You know what? They've already, they've already told us the story. Oi! I won't happy with the amount of replies on that story. If you haven't told us your story and we've just shared everything with you, you drop your comment down below. Drop your comment down below. Or tell us the funniest thing that's ever happened during doing it. Because you know what? Yeah, just we give enjoy us some funny doing this. Any funny stories in, in general, anyway. That are funny to read and we can actually laugh at. Look how much fun we're having doing this video. You know what I mean? If we could do this all the time, just speak to you guys about your experiences. Drop them down. We'll reply. If you are honest with us, we'll reply to you and, and we'll, we'll, be honest we'll have with a good you. relationship. You know what I mean? Simple. You're you know what I'm are you? That's the best stuff <laughs> I've drank in a long time. And on that note, guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, follow us on Instagram, all of that sort of stuff. Um, Oi, see so you at 500,000 subscribers. Oh, Sam peer pressured me and saying everything I just said. Three, Bang. two, one. Clock and lock, clock and lock. Three, two, one. Boom. <laughs> Oh, I think she likes that, but I'm not doing that today, I'm not doing that no, today. No, what if she likes it?